This is your National Registry Station for ventilatory management of a pediatric patient under two years of age. Okay. Let's take BSI, scene safety. Your scene is safe. Okay. I'm going to approach my patient. Baby, baby, are you okay? I'm going to go ahead and properly position the head. Look, listen, and feel for five, no more than ten seconds. Your patient does not appear to be breathing. All right. I'm going to position pad underneath the shoulder blades. So my patient is in the proper position. I'm going to go ahead and select my oral pharyngeal airway. Go across the corner of the mouth to the earlobe. I'm going to utilize my tongue depressor, since this is such a small child, and go with the natural curve for the OPA. No gag reflex is present, and patient accepts the adjunct. All right, I'm going to go ahead and bag my patient at one breath every five to six seconds. Ventilation is being performed without difficulty, and pulse oximetry indicates the patient's blood oxygen saturation is 85%. All right, at this time, I'm going to go ahead and hook my bag up to high flow oxygen and pass this off to a partner. We go ahead and listen for lung sounds. Checking bilaterally. Breath sounds are present, equal bilaterally, and medical direction has ordered intubation. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and direct my partner to um, pre-oxygenate the patient at one breath every three seconds. I'm going to check out my equipment, laryngoscope blade. I'm going to, for this procedure, I'm going to go ahead and utilize a Miller. Ensure that my light is white, tight, and bright. Let me go ahead and select my uncuffed ET tube, utilizing a 2.5 for this infant. My stylet is in place, not extending past the end of the ET tube. Next, I'm going to go ahead and direct my partner. On my count of three, I want you to go ahead and remove the BVM, remove the mask, and remove the OPA. Okay. All right, are you ready? Yep. One, two, three. I'm inserting my blade, I'm visualizing the glottic opening, displacing the jaw, I can see my tube passing into the trachea. Go ahead and ventilate please as I remove the stylet. Okay, at this point in time I'm going to go ahead and auscultate of the apigastrium, auscultate over uh, the lungs bilaterally. If you had proper placement, what should you expect to hear? I should expect to hear no gurgling in the apigastrium and clear lung sounds bilaterally. At this point in time, I'm going to go ahead and secure my tube with a commercial securing device. I am also noted that I'm at 10 centimeters at the lip. Not letting go of my tube. And my tube is secure. And I have tubed this patient. Is there anything else you'd like to do? That'll be it. Okay, this completes your station.